Oh, hello everybody and welcome to my first episode of my Age of Wonders Shadow Magic Let's Play. Age of Wonders Shadow Magic is a turn-based strategy game in a fantasy setting, so think civilization with fantasy and magic. It uh, was released in 2003, so it is quite an old game, so the graphics aren't uh, perfect, but um, I've enjoyed it a lot, so we're going to do a Let's Play of it. Um, I'm going to jump right in, single player scenario. Please load. Thank you. Okay, generate scenario. We're going to put the shadow land on. Two players, sounds good. Small map, I don't want this to take too long. Um, yeah, the rest of the settings are okay for me. Uh, CPU squire. No, we're going to fight a lord. We'll see if I can, uh, can win from this guy. It's been a while since I've played, and I've been even longer since I played against a, uh, a CPU lord. So we'll see how this goes. We'll do customize wizard. Allied victory is not really relevant in this case, so let's get started. Yep, custom wizard, that's what we want. Um, this is the class of magic, which our wizard will be, which is basically our leader. And we want a death specialist, because it synergizes very well with uh, evil evil races. And I want to play as the un undead, which have a particular usefulness for this death magic class. Uh, we're going to go with a uh, scholar. This gives us a research bonus, which I like. Now we need to pick the undead, which is the race we're playing. And let's get started. Oh, no, no, no. This picture will not do. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, looks nice. And of course our name. Okay, let's go. Cool. We started. This is very nice, right here. This is a death note, which will give us mana, which is our resource. Where well, our resources should have it. Mm, yeah, here our resources. We have zero mana currently, and we're increasing it with 13 mana each turn. We have 250 gold, which we use to construct stuff in our cities, and we are generating 23 gold each turn extra. And Holy Darkness, very powerful spell, but not the one I'm currently looking for. I'm looking for some kind of combat spell. Um, yeah, this is of course a combat spell, but it's 20 mana, which is a lot at first. So we're first going to go for Weaken, which is only 10 mana. We're going to see if we can boost this a little bit. Yeah, 3 turns, excellent. Okay. Um... What are we going to build here? I think we're going to just first increase our army. I think this would be best. So we're going to build a swordsman and an archer. We're going to leave our entire army here and go kill these guys. Now, in one of my test recordings, I immediately got my ass kicked at the very first, very first turn. So let's see if we can actually prevent this this time. Swordsman made, very good. Archer is being made. Weekend is currently going. Let's fight these guys. Okay. Now, this is the, the, the combat of this game. You see this is also a turn-based uh, system. So, yeah, here's my dudes. Here's his dudes. Because I attack, he gets to have the first turn. Which I guess is because of balance. Hmm. I would very much like to shoot this guy, but yeah, okay, we'll just go for this guy. Hit nothing. Perfect. There's a zombie, which is nice because this guy can, I can basically throw him at everything and he just keeps coming back, which is very, very nice. The fun thing with the zombies is you kill them quite easily. They just don't stay dead. They have this nice ability here. Resurgence. When a unit dies in combat, he'll just be back three turns later. <laughs> ah, undead. Okay, so we're going to send this archer forward. Can we hit him? Nope, well, we can't shoot at him. This guy has a shield, in her block, which blocks most uh, ranged attacks, so it's the chance of me hitting him was already quite small. And holy darkness. Uh, not too bad abilities. We're going to attack him. 
And we're going to miss. Perfect. Death Ray, are we going to use it? Yeah, may as well. Control animal, black bolts. No, you're the dangerous guy. You're going to get shot. These are orcs, by the way. If you play as the orc faction, you can build these units. But when not playing them, these are just random, randomly generated. What did he just do? Feral mount. Out of control, reducing its... Oh, okay, movement points. Ah, I don't care. He's right next to me. Our dudes are doing very well. <coughs> Don't you kill him already? Oh. All units moved. Okay. Just shoot him first. Just die! Oh, he'll be back, don't worry. There we go. What? Ah. Okay. Lost one dude more than I wanted to, but what you going to do? We got the power node, that's what matters, which gives us this nice income boost on our mana. Um, let's look further down, let's see what we can find. Build an archer, excellent. We're going to keep that archer here, we're going to need it. If somebody comes to attack. That was not very efficient, but oh well. Hmm... Archer... No, we need more units. I need an army. Okay, moving on. Weaken is research. Excellent. Unholy Champion is very powerful. Magic Fist as well. Unholy Darkness. This is a very powerful spell, but at the moment we cannot actually afford it. This will turn the entire land around uh, in my domain. So that is the region in these dotted lines. They come from cities with uh, wizard towers, so with these towers here. Unfortunately, it also costs 20 upkeep on my mana supply, which I currently cannot afford. It's, it is very powerful on my uh, my race, because it, well, it turns the land into this black death around me. Here, here, this is now green. If I were to activate this spell, it would slowly turn into this, also this decayed territory. Which is better for my cities, but not so much for my enemies, so... Yes. Oh yeah, we're going to pick a... Um, let's go for Unholy Champion. Join offer, very good. Ah, wizard. Here, yeah, spell casting. So this hero can also cast spells, which is very useful for us. Weaken, this is also a powerful spell. Uh, poison protection, yeah, sure, we'll take you. 125 gold? Ah, oh, it's a bargain. It's a bargain. Nope. More armies. Want more armies. Never enough armies. There we go. Send you off in a different direction. You're going to kill dwarves. Yeah, we're going to quick battle this one. Don't feel like looking at it. Production found, monastery or hall of enchantment. We're going to go for monastery, it increases our mana supply and it opens up a construction which will heal all of our units at the start of the turn, which is very nice. We are losing money. This is not good. Should probably stop making units then. Yeah, okay. Um, let us summon... Oh, I can't even... I don't have any summons. Uh, what shall we do? Yeah, sure, let's put this on a few guys. I'll give you... So, we've now buffed her. We've given her Dark Gift, which does plus one damage. It gives her plus one resistance, that's against magic damage, and gives her a Death Strike, which um, bestows death upon your enemies. <laughs> uh...
Dark gift ready. Very good. We're going to cast it on our two best units here. Good. This also costs a little upkeep, but I'm fine with that. These units are valuable to us, so may as well put some effort to them. Ah, here's our enemy. It's white, which means it's probably pure good. I have this this hunch that our enemy might be uh, the the pure good, so the the exact opposite of the the undead, which is very fun. This is a nice nice contrast. Ooh, camp to explore. Weak defenses. I think we can handle it with this uh, this troop here. Okay, very nice. Okay, is there something we can do here? Not really much. This will cost money. I don't have any money. And holy champion researched. Nice. Give me a summon. Ah, uh, come on. No summon yet. What do we have here? Ah. I'll just kill you. Ah, oh, we may as well show you this. Given that this is our first attack on the city. Now normally, when the city is a little bit developed, you will find a wall around the city. But given that this is not currently a very developed city yet, it's just the, the as it was spawned in by at the start of the match. It doesn't have a wall yet, so we can just walk in. Ah, uh, there we go. Roar. Hmm. You disappoint me, Archer. Better, better. Still not much, but better. Okay. Sword to the face. There we go. Thank you, Joseph. You're doing well. You're doing well. The real question is, are we going to keep these guys? What do you do? Plus 10% or oh, plus 10 production, which is nice. What do we do? Research. And we get a bonus from the terrain as well. Okay, I think we're going to convert this into our uh, undead. Migrate to undead. Here we go. We're not finding a lot of gold generating structures. This is actually hurting us a lot. Normally you would find small structures, much like this death node, which will give us gold, but currently I've not found any at all. Okay, manual battle. I think the CPU would screw this up if I would try. Yeah, you're going to spit, you're not going to hit though. It's probably a good idea to try and kill this guy downrange, so death ray for you. Excellent. This, if Leander kills us, she also gets the XP, which would be nice. So, nice hit. Oh yeah. Yeah, you can see her XP raised a little. And uh, if she gets a level up, we can boost her stats, which is very nice. Hmm you there. Now this guy might have wings, but he doesn't actually fly, thank god, because if this guy were to fly, he would... Uh, I would only be able to, to target him with spells and archery, then this skeleton dude would basically be here for... well, no reason actually, he'd just be here standing being pretty. So, nice that he doesn't be... that he can fly. Come on, hit him. You're not very good at this, aren't you? Nope. Miss. Hit him! Wow. <laughs> okay, this is just sad. Let's weaken him. Let's weaken him. Reduce his uh, defense and, uh, and, and resistance. So we will cause more damage. It would, however, help if they were actually to hit this guy. Ah, this is better. Now kill him. Thank you. We might lose our swordman here. We'll see. Oh, no, he's not better at <laughs> aiming than my dudes either. <laughs> oh, early game. This is so much fun. Oh, fire armor. Yes, we'll pick this up. Plus two fire immunity and cold weakness. Well, I'm not expecting to run into any dudes with uh, cold attacks, so... But if we see any, we might want to switch. 
We do have a second city, which actually makes me happy. Once this turns, we will get a lot of income from this. So, three more turns, three more turns. Okay. Enchanted weapons researched. Give me... Ah, oh, still no summon. Come on, man. <laughs> Give me a summon. I want to summon some creatures. Um, what shall we do? Ah, unholy darkness. Why not? Why not? Migrate to undead. Two more turns. Get some money. Yeah. What do we have here? Ooh. Yeah, we can't handle these defenses with this guy. We don't have to go here. Very disappointed with with the, the the random generator here. Normally you can you get more stuff to capture, so we would have more gold income now. But let's hope our enemy doesn't have as much gold either. Oh, more gold! It's only temporary though. We spend this so quickly. Uh, warhol, perhaps. Oh, yep, yeah, we're building a warhol. Mm, losing some cash, oh well. Next turn we'll get the income of the second city. Perfect. Still no, evil woods. Ah, uh, it can be useful, let's just do that. Uh, we can use, well, two arches is enough for now. Let's explore a little around here. Come on, just give me a gold generating structure. Too much to ask, apparently. Okay. Um. Oh, here we go. Found it. You're dead. Uh, I'll do this manual as well. Okay, Archer. He almost shot his friend in the back of the head. Always a nice thing to do. Okay. So this guy does not have a shield, so this would be a prime target for my archer. There we go, arrow to the face. You will block the archer. How far can I go? We'll go to the back of here. Um, I think we're going to weaken him. There we go. You basically have no more defense and resistance left. Heh <laughs> Um... This is nice. Evil bonus attack. Good. Weakened defense and resistance, but it's also very expensive. I prefer death ray. Bang! Okay. <laughs> uh, they really cannot aim. No, oh, you can't shoot today. Mm, we're just going to stab you. Very good. One, two, three, and you're dead. Oh, he's moved. Uh, let's put a death ray on him. Probably kill him next turn. Ha! Kill him with the hero, get the XP on him. Her. This is a her. Yeah, it's a her. Oops. Yes, money! Look at this! This is why it's so important. This is also income, I think. Yes, 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 yes. Very good, very good. Oh man, for a moment there I was afraid I would not have any of these structures. That's usually how you lose games. Uh. Okay, next turn. Spellcasting 2 or willpower? Willpower makes me immune to control, so control spells. So for instance there are spells in the game which would uh, make you gain control of units that are not yours. So yeah. Willpower will make sure that doesn't happen. Spell casting however gives me more of these points here where which I can use to cast damaging spells and of course damage itself is also very nice but we're going to go for willpower it's not one you see a lot so let's go for that. Mm, more money. No do a quick battle here. And of course we lose a guy. Oh boy. Oh boy. These are powerful units. 
This guy is strong. This guy is also strong. Ooh. Annual battle. First thing first. Let's weaken all things. Uh, unfortunately, because we... So, uh, because these guys are also evil, the unholy darkness will not actually help us a lot. Actually, I'm quite certain it will hurt us. Okay, very good. We hit him. Now, approach my enemy. <laughs> uh, come on. Um, death ray. Not enough casting points. No. Uh, you a death ray then. I need this guy to die. Come on, kill him. Oh yeah. Okay, we've got a chance. Are you in range? Only just? Oh, I might die here. Yeah. Okay, okay, we're still working here. You have a ton of defense. Wow, look at this magic resist. Or is this resistance, I should say. Wow, that worked. Really, really well. <coughs> okay. Yeah, slap him. There we go, he's dead. What did you do? Oh, he stole my shot. You bastard. Oh, we're going to lose her, aren't we? We die here. Yeah. Ah, damn. That stinks. Well, of course, also not finding anything here. That would be too easy. Well, not having the best start here. Death must. Oh, come on. I don't need any of this. this. These are so powerful late game spells, but right now I have no use for them at all. Ah, shadow walking then. Look at this. A whole lot of nothing. Oh, oh, I see something there. Maybe it's something good. Maybe... We are in a whole world of hurt. Um, yeah. Oh, okay, let's build some units. <laughs> the vampire, this is actually a good unit. We're going to build one of these. Okay, now what is it? Well, okay. <laughs> we can't kill that, I don't think so. Uh, maybe we can. Let's give it a shot. Next turn! <laughs> uh. Vampire, okay. We will eventually get a spell that can summon these. They're very powerful units. Let's hope I can handle them. Should I walk in researched? Do we have something useful now? Well, double gravity is actually quite useful. Yes. Yes, we need a wall here. We're going to try it. Manual battle. He's probably going to use his fire spell, so we want to spread out as much as we can. You are meat shield. Congratulations. Oh boy. Weaken. Put you there. There. Uh, would have been nice if we had the the champion with the the magic abilities. That would have been very powerful, actually. Yeah. Uh. Oh, yep. We're getting burned. Okay, we're not doing too bad, actually. He's getting a lot of damage. Let's do a death ray. Maybe that will kill him. <laughs> Did nothing. 
Oh, there we go. And he's dead. Kill him! By kill him, I mean actually hit him. That would be nice. Oh, we're in trouble. Oh, maybe not. If we kill him here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Dragon Hatchling. Morale, okay. What kind of alignment do you have? Doesn't tell. We don't have the money for it. Let's look around a little. Shall we get a hatchling? Yeah, yeah, let's get one. Let's get a hatchling. Oh, hello. Let's fight. <laughs> At least this time we've got an army to fight them with. Okay. If we get this guy to gold level, he will turn into a full-blown dragon, which is very powerful. Here you can see it transforms the hatchling into a mature dragon when it reaches gold level. I think it's random, so that's actually not that good for us, because there are not a lot of dragons which are okay with working with um, the undead. We are too evil for most of them, but if he turns into a bone dragon, we should be okay. Yeah, put your archer here. Go. Put the tiny whiny little dragon here. He is quite cute. Yeah, dragon hatchling. Oh, is my zombie going to die for a bit? He might. There we go. Fire breath. There we go. Yeah. You're getting stabbed. We need to work on these people's accuracy. They're not doing very well. It would have been nice to give him the XP, the dragon. But we're not going to take any risks. Our guys are a bit low, so... Vampire, one turn. Good. That's a very powerful unit. Uh, yeah, we need the money. Of course, there's nothing here. Yeah. Okay. At least this guy is generating money for us. Double gravity research. Come on, give me a summon. Please give me a summon. Oh. What am I going to do with this? May as well research Darkland. Produce merchandise. Another vampire would actually be nice, but let's let's generate a little merchandise. Should another hero show up next turn, we actually might be able to hire him. Otherwise we're going to have to let him just go, which is not something I want to do. Builders Hall, yes that would be nice, but unfortunately we need money. Juice merchandise. Yeah. One more turn, one more turn of producing merchandise. Okay. Very well. Still don't have much spells to work with. I really want a spell here which summons a creature. The, the creatures you summon with, with, with spells are amongst the most powerful of the game, so it would be very nice if we could get our hands on one, but s s right now it's just not, not giving, the, uh, giving us the research we need for it. But um, to see what happens next time, you're just going to have to watch the next episode, because that's it for today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you liked, please leave a like, and I see you next time.